Dear Diary, it's the 3rd of December 2020. I really hope that I'm making the right decision. Ah, shit, was this really a good idea? I mean, yeah, I love him. I've loved him more than I've ever loved anyone, but there are some things that I just don't want to leave behind. Like I was going to try out for art school. Chase my dreams of becoming a... <sighs> shit. Am I giving this up now that I'm leaving? Does he want me to give this up? No, no, he's not like that. He's always been supportive of me. More than my parents, anyway. Oh no, shit, my parents. They're gonna get so mad at me for this. Ugh, get it together, Rue. Joshua's probably waiting for you. He's probably standing right outside your house right now. I just need to remind myself that as long as I have- We are better off like this, Rue. Believe me. Our homes? They were never homes. They were cages, and we managed to escape. We'll support each other no matter what, right? Come on. Let's get out of here. You're drawing again? Well noticed. I guess you're not that drunk. What, what are you drawing anyways? <laughs> As if you'd care. You're right. I don't. It's a bird. I... I don't like it when you're drunk. It's... It reminds me of your father. You think I'm like my father? Have, have I ever laid a single finger on you? I never said that. It's just... You promised me that we would support each other no matter what and... You don't know half of what my father's like. Then tell me! You really want to know? He's drunk most of the time. Angry all the time. He would start beating me when I'd look at him the wrong way. This one time, it was so bad, he bruised my fucking ribs. I couldn't go to a hospital because he had spent all of our money at some bar. Can you blame me for being the way I am? I left for you. Do you hear me? I left for you. It was you who asked me to come along. You decided to throw away your dreams and work at your dad's shop. But you didn't have to throw away your future. You still don't understand, huh? <gasps> I do understand, Joshua. You've always told me to follow my dreams, and I did. But when you graduated, you realized that you couldn't afford to do the same. You started working at your dad's shop because someone had to put an actual meal on the table and tell your mom that it's gonna be okay and take the blows for your siblings. People who didn't know all this were disappointed in you, but not me. No, I believed in you. I loved you, Joshua. I fucking loved you. But I was never planning on giving up my dreams. You can't expect me to do that. Yes, I made you run away with me. But I did so because I was scared of losing you, Rue. I did so because I love you. If you really loved me, you would have let me keep my wings. I just need to remind myself that as long as I have my wings, I'll be free.